So guys, I updated the rearview mirror to this Wolf Box. I believe this is the 860. Some of the features this thing has is pretty cool. So this is the rear view. I hung my camera right there inside. You can you can scroll up and down if you wanted to, which is pretty cool. It's pretty wide also. Um, you swipe sideways and it goes to the front cam. Same thing with that, up and down, pretty cool. Swipe again, you get this split view, front and back. I went ahead and purchased this so you can hang it from your uh, rear, original rear view mirror um, bracket thingy. So I'm not, you know, clamping it on to the, to the old one. I, I kind of didn't like the way it looked. It was kind of bulky. So this is just like a bracket that attaches from here. Um, this whole piece is a part of it. And then it just slides into your old existing one. So when I back up, I'm still using this, but this is also nice to see a higher view because you can see it, it doesn't really show up there. And this one does so playback. It's pretty cool. You can show it on here. It shows you everything you're recording. You can see there, you can switch from front and back, which I think it's this one. There you go. So this is the back. You see that the front. I had some minor issues with transferring the footage from the mini SD card in there to the computer but wolfbox was super patient and super helpful they sent me a bunch of cards to see what was the problem and one of them worked so everything worked out oh i really like it i like this option better of like hanging it from a bracket instead of just clamping it onto the existing one the camera does adjust as you can see there it's pretty cool nighttime let's talk about nighttime so this thing during the night is the rear cam is pretty low quality the 1080p cam um, at night is not great it's you know grainy a bit blurry at best and um i might look into upgrading just the rear camera if that's even a possibility because yeah but aside from that, guys, I love this thing. I'd give it an 8 out of 10.